Hello, hello, Danger Noodles. It is I, the Great Dr. Bright, here uh, to uh, basically play... Fuck, I forgot its name. But I think it's like a mall near you or something like that. Yeah, a mall near you. That's its name. A fucking moron. But anyways, uh, hello, uh, hello, person in chat. How's it hanging? Anyways. Alright, kiddo. You got all the stuff in your backpack, right? Because if you don't, we're not turning around. We need a gift for the holidays. And we got to return some items to afford it. Remember, the start plush, the star plushy thing to Jill's, the t-shirt to warm subject, and the sponge to bathroom delights. I'll pick you up behind the saws try to get a good gift while you're in there okay like that box of max and mac and cheese the one with the famous italian guy on it if i give it to your pops he'll be real happy don't worry you'll be fine you're a big brave kid all right see ya wow i'm abandoned Enter them all? Yes. Um. Yes, this is Jill's. Oh, hi. How are you? Wow. Shut up like a little bit before close time. Oh, right. I should probably like do my job. Hey. Welcome to Chills and stuff. Need any help? I gotta return this. You wanna return? Right. Yeah, here. I'll give you a fiver for this. Alright, cool. One of these star-shaped sucky things. Yeah, some kids claim these things start biting them. For real though, you should probably hurry up and go home. It's getting late. Oh, oh, oh no, she's not. Oh no. But, hatchet. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh. Oh. Hold on. I gotta do a quick message or something. Anyways, now I'm back. So we return one item. Zero out of ten. What's zero out of ten? Here's a vending machine. Got a bunch of really, really old snack bags in it. What the fuck? There's an ambulance outside my house. Well, they're not staying at my house, so I guess it's someone else in my neighborhood. Hopefully they're okay. And the ones you do recognize have looked as what you've never seen. You want to buy a bag? I have a feeling I'm going to need a bag. Regardless of your choice, a bag of chalks pops out of the slot. The main machine is clearly on the fritz. Chalks. You're not familiar with the brand, but it advertises itself as a challenge snack. I'm 
Uncle Urkels. I am never doing that voice again. He just gave this to you. For free? It doesn't actually look that appetizing. Now that you're closer up to it, but free is free. You take the pretzel and wrap it up for now. It'll be wrong to eat it here. Thanks, bud. Okay, so we need to get in there somehow. So, uh, Twitch manager guy in chat, are you still there? You haven't answered in a while. What the fuck? Oh my god. Then <laughs> come freak. Hems, I can say it's not in you. But not, but only a little bit. That instinct. A shrug does just grow. You're interested in the election, aren't you? No, I know. It's not the same as what I'm doing. Not the same as what I've given up to reach this point. Come back with your collection and test goods in the war. And I'll let you do tours. Okay, so I need to come back to him. I'm guessing... Some stuff... Yo, well, I got no warm subject. You need something, bud? I gotta return this. A return, huh? Yeah, sure, no problem. It's just ten bucks back for it. What's this return here? Oh, heh. Someone got you this shirt, but you didn't hold want to hold on to it? Don't worry, I can relate. <laughs> She's like, too. God damn it, Hatchet. <laughs> Honestly, kind of surprised someone gave you this. This girl's from a, from a pretty obscure show, and it's not exactly for kids. I want to try something. Alright. I'm just trying something. Probably something stupid, but I'm trying it. Wow, what's this? It's one of those cool pet games, like the one from Jill's. The screen is broken, and this and the sound is cracky, crackly, but it still works. Your mom told you not to root around in the trash. What does she know? Got three of ten. Oh, hello, bud. Oh, shucks. Boss is gonna be real cheesed off if I don't finish up in time. Oh, hi, kid. Sorry. Just muttering something to myself. Ain't you worry about it. Go have yourself a good day, okay? What's wrong? You really wanna know? Okay, okay, fine. Can't say no to a helping hand. Even if it is for a little kid. Need something that can carry a whole lot of water in a tiny package. And I mean a lot of water. It's gonna absorb the stuff. Most importantly, it's already gotta be carrying that water. The wet, wet water. Need one. You got one? Yeah. Don't bother, kid. I already know you don't got anything like that on you. Like a fifth sense. Sixth sense, whatever. Doesn't matter. Can't do no real work without it. Much obliged for offering, though. Maybe one day I'll find one somewhere. Okay, so there's actually a bunch of stuff I have to do here. Hey, ya! Welcome to Bathroom Delights. What's up? How can I help you? You gotta return this. Oh, dear. Um... Really sorry to tell you this, but I don't think I can accept this. 
I don't know where you got this from, but it definitely couldn't be from our store. They look kind of like ours, but they were taken off the market years ago for being illegally potent at sucking up water. Sorry, I really wish I could help you more. Have a good one, okay? Mall's closing up real soon. Your nose is burning, but you can't stop smelling. Oh wait, I got an idea. Is there a fountain around here? Because if there's a fountain, I can see if I can put... Aha! This fountain kind of smells. Might be the stack stagnant water. It looks like it hasn't turned in a while. No coins in here, besides that big coin in the middle of it. We've got a sponge. Though using it here would probably void any kind of warranty for turns. Do you hate water that much? I can't even return it, so yes. The terrifying suction localized in the palm of your valid fist. All of your fountain's water sorps into your sponge. You've done it. The water is all gone. And so is your sponge. Actually, not really. The water is still there. Your sponge is still there, too. They just become one single thing. A wet sponge. It's really heavy. You go ahead and snatch up the big coin while you're at it. Yoink. Weird. The moment you pick it up, you feel a, pe a pair of wizened old eyes on you. What do you mean? There's... Are, are you saying there's someone watching me? Oh, hi! Um, hi there. How are you? Run fucking off? So now I should be able to give the sponge to you. Hey, you got it, don't you, kid? That thing, I can smell it from here. I might have established that I can do that. Doesn't matter if, if I did it. Because that's a real powerful tool you got in your hands there, kid. How about it? Give me a what sponge. Promise I'll make it worth your while. Yep. Shucks, kid. Really made my day giving me that. Should be able to get all my work done for the night now. Here. This is for you, kid. A key. Should be able to open the gates to the arcade with that. Kids like arcades, right? Oh, sweet. Wait, what? Oh, I thought that was a person right there. No, it's just a bunch of chairs. It's still locked. Use the key the janitor gave you? Yeah. You wedge the key into the gates. And violently pry the gates open, bursting it open into a harsh, wirely metallic balloon. You feel confident about your child's strength. Now you can enter the arcade. Dear God! <laughs> I am one strong child. Anyone here? No. Oh, I can go right here. Okay, I don't like that. No, 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 no. I didn't even touch it and it, and it fell apart. This wig. Uncle would love this for his head. It's quite greasy. Hmm. I wonder if I can talk to the comic book guy now. Or the Funko Pop guy. Whatever the fuck you want to call him. Hmm. I can sense in you, but only a little bit. That's an instinct. Spark that has yet to do. You're instant in connection, aren't you? No, I know. That's the same as what I'm doing. That's the same as what I'm doing at the reach this point. Come back when your connection has grown a little bit a little more, and I'll add to yours. Well, fuck you. I got like six items. Fucking bitch. Okay, so let's continue exploring down here. Too stanky to go in there. You need to get out of here now. Oh, okay. I, I agree with you, bud. No entry. That's back over there. I guess I can go up here. Huh. 
<laughs> oh my god. I found Hatch's birth uh Christmas gift. This is Hatch's Christmas gift right here. This is freaking sweet. You wish dinosaurs were real. Hey, us, but you know where you are now? A furniture outlet. An outlet for all your furniture needs. Like this, my, like the model? I came up with it myself. Can't wait to hear what, what Corporate has to say about it. Silly me, though. I should be asking what you need. What do you need, champ? Uh, no, accurate enough. I don't see any royal feathers on that right. Can I have that dinosaur? No, oh, that's... Sorry, amigo, but no can do. That girl there is the cornerstone of my store. She's the heart of this business. I can't even think about what my store would be without her. Yeah, but check this out. Oh my! You've really knocked it out of the park with that one, hot shot. It's been a long time since I've seen a trick that sick. As in cool. It really brings me back to my childhood. Can you show me how to, you did it? Yeah, for a price. There's a lot I can give you for that knowledge. A new couch for your family, maybe? A dining table? Or how about a chair? You know chairs are all in the range right now. How about a superstar? Dinosaur. Done. Expect it tomorrow. Fuck yeah. Reserved. I got the dino sure. Oh my gosh, it's Jack Frost. The Polar Express. Did they actually make a Polar Express 2? Please tell me they did not make a Polar Express 2. I have a feeling that's our other horror game right there. Sorry, Rickus. You watched your first movie here. Then your second, and third, and fourth. The lineup hasn't really changed since then. Not that any of it matters now that it's been closed down for good. Luckily for you, you still got your uncle's DIVX collection to watch at home. Movie magic still springs eternal with DIVX. I don't even know what the fuck that is. Oh, oh, pardon me, child. But did you just drain the fountain with a sponge? Was it just because you could? Well, I'll not go look a gift horse in the mouth, assuming the horse is inclined to give me a gift, of course. My young heroic friend, would you do me the honor of giving me that big coin? Promise to make it worth your while. I guess. Many thanks, my precious friend. Now test it just me of this currency as only a professional con. It's delicious. There's no doubt in it now. This is a real deal indeed. As promised, here's your reward. A blank check from me to you. Don't spend it all in one place, yes. Not that you could. I promise that no number you put on there would be enough to hurt me. Ha <laughs> ha. I am richer than most countries. As for me, this beautiful piece of history shall go right into my pocket. Ah, uh, I can feel it's in acceptance weight upon me already. A big coin fell out of the old man's pocket. Take it. He <laughs> just stole from him. <laughs> <laughs> You're a fucking moron. <laughs> this is where I need to go. I can't remember. Now this is the beginning of the store. This is definitely where I need to go. But there's a couple things in here. 
a cutout of a famous Hollywood actor, Brendan Fraser, depicted on the heroic Rick O'Connell from The Mummy, 1999. It's fair to say that his performance in that film was, absolute, was an absolute breakout. Your mom loves this movie, and this man, and make her real happy. You'd love to ask Cashier about the price, but she seems to be asleep. A bunch of bread and macaroni and cheese boxes spread loosely on the table. Alright. Tony's Macaroni. A middling successful attempt to use James Gandolfini's likeness to push packs of macaroni. And make a mildly successful gift, but the clerk is currently too asleep to sell it to you. <laughs> Oh, yeah, hey, can I help you? Are you, uh, trying to buy something? Cause you're not soon, so... If you want any of this stuff, go ahead and, like, look at it and stuff. Oh, yeah, Tony's Macaronis. Tony Macarons. Tonus Macaronis. Yeah, uh, f f 15 bucks, sure. Uh... You like a dog off, sorry, but I can't shell it to you. Not even you asked twice. Oh, would you like to print and cut out? Um, so like, that's not supposed to be for sale. But if you like to have a lot of money or something, I could sell it to you. I have to get a really goofy amount of money though. Okay. What? Uh, um, okay, fine. Yeah, sure, I'll take that check, and you can, yeah, yeah, it's yours. Okay, so I need to earn more money. So I got 8 out of 10, so maybe... I can go back to that guy now. See if he'll give me something new. Yes, that's it. You fed flames, haven't you? Scrounge and straps until you've gotten just about everything you can find in this place. I wish I did that as other people with this kind of fire. I admire that. I appreciate it. Here, one more correction. I am grateful. Grateful to have come here. Grateful to have missed you. Now there's no doubt worth it. Chill. Try not to aim like V, if you can help it. It's nice to have a hobby, but that's not always true for exceptions. So I somehow need to make money. Yeah. It's pretty wet, but it's still not saying quite as much, huh? That sponge. Not that sponge. Give it away, huh? That's probably for the best, really. That stuff really dangerous. I'm sure it's in right hands now. Out of sight, out of mind, right? Okay, it's not what I want. Oh yeah, even if I ask her twice. I wonder if what happens if I do ask her twice. Will she just give it to me? Because I don't see anywhere I can get money. Chinese Mac, do you have enough money for it now? Sure, huh? Of course you oh fine. Also yours. Yeah now she said the back of Saul's, right? Yeah, right here. Okay, so let's just go over here. Oh, the exit right there. I'm an idiot. I I got ten out of ten. What's going on? Yeah. 
Okay, okay. You're done sharpening here and stuff. Because if my ever's is done here and stuff, I'm gonna go and close up. Like, the home wall will close up too, probably. So, are you done shopping? Yeah. Real last confirmation. The mall will close when you agree. Yeah, close it, dude. I got 10 out of 10, so I know I got all my stuff. Okay, man. An infinite hallway or something? Jesus Christ. Hey, what are you doing back here? Oh, it's just you. Sorry. I think I was walking to my car so I could, like, go home. Hey, kid, it's, like, really late. Someone's supposed to be picking you up. The exit's down this way. Or, um, in front of you. Sorry, I'm a little bleary-eyed. I'm gonna take a breather for a sec before I go home myself. The end. 10 out of 10 gifts. Also, how is this a horror game? It wasn't really scary. Well, it looks like I got it all. I'll see bookworm in here. Okay, so I go here. Go there. Ooh. There. And then delete you. What's that? Oh, I should probably <laughs> Next game will be the Rusty Barrel. I have no idea if it's good. Or if it has a string category. Oh, it for a fact does. Weirdly enough. Yeah, 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 fuck off. Alright, the rusty barrel. Hello? 
There are sea barrels on all deep sea submarines that specialize in collecting minerals from the ocean floor. This marine has rather modest characteristics. It is slow and has limited mobility. It is diff extremely difficult to work in narrow spaces. Main task is to collect minerals from the ocean floor and deliver them to the destination. You'll be have to operate in narrow gorges at a depth of more than 4,000 meters. Be careful as the submarine is fragile and leaks are possible. For such cases, you'll have a repair tool. Good luck. get through the first game yeah oh my god and I'm back is this a 3d version of iron lung it's the move oh dear god also 3d oh true the controls are way different too oh god oh god okay wait negative one I'm trying to go to 15. God damn it. Okay. There we go. So now I'm confused. This game's confusing me. Because <laughs> there's a wall there, so I can't go that way. Give me that bitch. Uh, that didn't really attach, but okay. Okay, so where is it gonna start getting terrifying? Oh, they have little fishies, Hatch. Look at the little fishies. I can't even tell what fish those are, but since we're below 4,000 meters, this is probably deep sea fish. And I can apparently hit them with the submarine. Make sure there's no leaks, no leaks, no leaks. Wait! <laughs> Is that a goose of a sailor hat? Oh shit. I can't tell if that's what I'm supposed to do or not. Yeah, it kind of looks like it is. Okay, so I gotta be very careful. so far. 
it not hitting anything. I believe. Yeah, there's no damage. No damage. Okay. And grab. I... Okay. <laughs> I think those are supposed to be ghost sharks. A type of kind of fish. Presently living where I live. So sharks are rising. Oh, cool. Oh, no, 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 no. Forward a bit. What the fuck? No. No. Gushi. Oh my gosh! I can actually click it. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, that looks very similar. This one's gonna be far. No, some so of those like like fucking sunfish. Oh. Well, I'm not a fish expert like you, so. I want to catch up on it. Why does it feel like I'm being chased? This is putting me on edge. Oh, I don't like the sounds. I let go. Oh, it's on cool. Fuck off. Did 
Okay, so something's constantly attacking my fucking ship. Yeah, it's a jellyfish. I have no idea what jellyfish that is, but yeah, that is in fact jellyfish. Hundred percent one of the items I need. Now there's only one left. It's taking some miles, a small and large mouth pass in a place in the Greek coast white, which is Really funny to me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh. Whoever is targeting me, can you please leave me alone? Why am Why am I on edge? Yeah, if only we had something like this an iron lung then there wouldn't be any worries about uh, damages Excuse you? Uh, hi there! Honestly, that wasn't bad. A second of intermission image right before the transmission. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. That was weird. Okay. I'm gonna be right back. Alright. Patch it. Entertain the stream somehow. <laughs> 